Our story begins a couple of hours after Wyatt. post up I think. Should have enough to get some down just for the minute. as well. Huge. Go deeper this. We need that shit. Gonna go head up to the supermarket again. Pick up the workbench over there. Jesus, that scared me. This is where I was introduced to the antagonist of this story. You'll be seeing a lot of them throughout this video. I don't have a bag at base, I'm gonna have to run, either try and get a spawn there, or we'll run back. There's a guy in that route, there's a guy still on the supermarket roof. Three of them, maybe more. <laughs> Come on, bro. Is that necessary? <sighs> After an additional two attempts trying to get back home, I eventually made it back during the night. RKS ended up taking my level 1 workbench, but I got some stone home which would let me upgrade. Jeez, bro. Finally. Might try and go grub. With no real gear in base, I decided to craft an Eoka and just go grub the clan.
five star wanted level boys. I think we got him. at this point. Um, probably got a farm, unfortunately. I'm gonna go ahead a few nodules. A few sh nodules. Got labs. Labs might be an idea. After a bit of time farming, I finally made my way to Fishing Village, where the plan was to go farm underwater labs, but I was quickly sidetracked. there as well. I'm being greedy with it. I need it. Is that me? What are these bots doing, dude? How does he see me? Buy boat because soon. Gear up. This is scary. No. Bruh. Oh my god. Well, 
At this point, I wanted to farm for a bit, but there was so much activity in the area that I couldn't resist grubbing. No! How'd that not get him? There was a raid happening nearby, so I decided to craft some Eokas and go mess with them. This is online. Hit me, up me, up me. Ooh. And it just loaded. Shit, I'll fuck you up later. Looking like an animal and still can't uh, do it. Bruh. Can't see the thing going. Oh, Jesus Christ. As you can see here, I was starting to get on their nerves. Dude, he is mad, bro. They're very upset. However, this just made me want to grub them even more. They had finished the first raid, but were now raiding another base in the area. They're still going. After scraping up a prim kit from this raid, I decided to go to their base and grub them for a bit. Thank you. 
think he's cheating. This might have just been cope, but I was pretty certain some of the team members were cheating. Are you stupid? Are you retarded? Shoot out. Hey, hey, shoot out, shoot out, shoot out. Do you want to be my slave? Do you want to be my slave? <laughs> yes or no, yes or no. Fuck your dancing shit, fuck off. <laughs> After messing with them for a little while, I turn my focus to just farming for a bit. While on a farm run, I found this decaying base. Although it hadn't opened yet, it was very close to. Holy fuck, this is very close to decaying. I AFK'd in base for a while, and then after returning, I decided to check the decaying base. <laughs> okay. <gasps> Whoa! Four. Holy shit! What is this? Get that cloth off.
Tier 3 even. Not quite. After getting a tier 2 down, I continued to farm. I spent the night researching important items like semi-auto rifle, rifle bullet, and med. Alright, got our blueprints, let's go. Should get a new monument. During the recording of this, the missile silo was a brand new addition to the game, so I wanted to go check it out. monument completely blind. I didn't realize I needed cards, so I made my way to the nearby harbor, but not before killing a loaded farmer.
26 bullets left. more times. It's a different one. Oh man, I might bleed out. Quick. Quickly. <laughs> Holy shit. So like the smooth brain I am, I ended up dying to NPCs. I get back up and headed back over. I decided to maybe give it a break and maybe try it another time when I was more prepared. So I went to something a little more suited to my skill level, the supermarket. I'm gonna head up to nearby supermarket. Still up there looking. Wow. Look at that. They're just watching. Fuck, did they chop me up? Bruh. They chopped my body up. Fuck, I wanna come back here with a DB, man. I think there's a DB somewhere. Else. 200 for a pump. 
After losing an AK to just pure greed, I crafted a pumpy and went to grub again. Dead, bro. Stupid bitch. You got you so stupid, bro. You so stupid, you know that, bro? You so dumb, bro. You so dumb. You so dumb. You so dumb. You so dumb. You so dumb, bro. <laughs> Damn. Ah, all right. <laughs> I might leave him alone now. <sighs> I'm gonna research Thompson, I think. And then I'm gonna have to farm. Yeah. as well. Farm trees, bro. Haha. <laughs> there he is. I can at least get my salvaged axe back. Sweet. just hopped out. Three people. I'll try and fight them. Let's do this. Oh, they're here. Wait, what? Is this their base? They're in there. Must be getting the scraps out of the base or something.
Damn it. Fuck, do I just take the AK out? Fuck it, dude. Take the AK out. to leave. We got some back. That was worth, I guess. Got MP5. There's the other one. Fuck. Took three of them, bro. Look, there's four of them, come. These freaks, bro. Look at this, dude. Guess that there's four of them out roaming, and there's gonna be more of them like still at base. See if they left any doors open. The builders at base. Hey, what up, stupid? <laughs> I kept killing this player heading in and out of this cave, so I decided it might be a good raid target considering that it looked cheap. So back at base I gathered all my gunpowder and crafted satchels.
This is probably more cope, but this player I was also suspect of cheating. I logged off for the night and unfortunately I had logged back on the next day to a raided base. Determined to keep the wipe going, I retreated to the cave base. So this was the last day that had any real significant uh, interaction with the clan. Oh. No! Fuck! a bit of grubbing and just messing around at the supermarket. It wasn't anything crazy. Three, two, three. I spent the next day farming a bunch because I ultimately wanted to end up raiding the clan as an ending to the video. But ultimately, this was pointless. Um, I was too late to the party. Someone else had beaten me to raiding them. So I went back to my cave and just lived out the rest of the wipe. Um, there was no real ending to it. I guess the takeaway from this is that the solo grub out survived the clan or some shit. <laughs> I don't know. Anyway, I mean, this was the f my first like real proper Ross movie.
Um, I know it's a bit goofy and these voiceovers suck, but I'm still working on them. Um, I hope everyone enjoyed watching it. I hope everyone watched the end. Um, but yeah, that's about it. Um, thanks for watching, and I'll catch you later.